And welcome back to our recurring vlog, entry 259. Today we are continuing the weekly story on Marcel Catat, aka Dr. Seaton. Without further ado, let's get right to it. Part 2. An unstable doctor becomes, becomes an unstable mayor. In 1926, this same year he may have killed his girlfriend, the case was dismissed because authorities believed her to be a runaway. Petrot ran for mayor in the small town of Villeneuve sur Yone. Hopefully, I'm saying this right. After engaging in shady tax tactics, sorry if I'm messing up, such as hiring someone to disrupt his opponent during a debate, the French doctor won. Again, he turned to stealing, embezzling town money. After Piot's questionable financial dealings came to light in 1931, he was convicted of fraud and suspended for a mere four months. He resigned but ran for a different office just five weeks later. This time, the still popular politician was elected as a local councillor. It wasn't long before the thief struck again. In 1932, he was convicted of stealing electricity from the town. It would be four more years before the doctor was finally institutionalized for kleptomania. He'd be released in just a year. Seems to me that when it comes to these types of things, People aren't very smart when making decisions. If he was stealing, he's obviously going to steal again. So why would you re-elect him for a different position? Like, does that make any sense? I'm pro that's probably just me thinking though. Next time we will be doing part 3, so stay tuned for that. Be sure to give the video a like, comment down below. Also hit the subscribe and the bell notification so you're made aware of new videos. And I think that's it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace, love, and funkiness. Bye guys.